पोर्सिलिन जैकेट क्राउन कैन बेस्ट टॉलरेट विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग फोर्सेज पोर्सिलिन जैकेट क्राउन इज अ टाइप ऑफ एन ऑल सिरामिक क्राउन पोर्सिलिन जैकेट क्राउन which were indicated mainly for single central incisors so this was an older concept when the ceramics was still evolving it uh, used a tin foil for processing so during the firing tin foil would act as a, a substitute that would ensure that all the layers of porcelain were fused to each other well but because of repeated firing and because of the fault in the process the ceramic was very brittle in nature okay now on parallel lines maclean and huges they developed they uh, reworked on the system and developed the aluminous porcelain with 40 to 50% of alumina for again strengthening ceramics and that's how uh, ceramics have in, evolved over a period of time so what happens with this is that the core material like alumina or uh, zirconia these get embedded in the ceramic matrix and they do not allow crack propagation now why does this crack propagation occur it's that is because the tensile strength of uh, the porcelain jacket crown is lesser as compared to the compressive strength now understand this difference so that you can understand the difference between hardness and brittleness both are different right something which can be easily compressed will not be hard it will be soft so this has high compressive strength and therefore it is hard the compressive strength is of the range in 350 to 500 megapascals hard okay it is understood that it will if it is very hard if it is harder than enamel then it is going to abrade enamel so that is one disadvantage of pgc that is why it is not used in overbite cases or in faulty faulty uh, occlusal schemes on the other hand tensile strength is how easily you can pull or you can stretch something okay so tensile strength and compressive strength are nearly opposite of each other so if it is easily pulled and if it fractures then it is brittle in nature so the tensile strength of this material is nearly 20 to 60 megapascals as compared to the compressive strength which i told you is nearly 10 times greater or more rather so tensile strength is lesser than the compressive strength so the question best tolerate which of the following forces compressive forces shearing forces and tensile forces and none of the above talking of shearing forces shearing forces are surface forces that act on the surface okay so that shows how easily a surface can be abraded so uh talking of these forces the most tolerated one is compressive followed by shearing and then tensile st stress so in this order the forces are tolerated by the porcelain jacket crown so the best answer here is compressive forces that is option number 1